Hey, good, hey, good morning, good afternoon, everyone. How are we today? Another great update for Pepper Attack. Already done a couple where we've covered the sort of the white paper and going through, uh, gone through the, I guess the the game mechanics. Um, did another update in regards to a NFT drop, um, and we want to just grab another one because we've got the mining coming up soon. We've got alpha testing for the game coming up soon. Um, so I just wanted to give a little bit of an update on the on the game because it's exciting times. September and October have been absolutely crazy with game launches, uh, token launches, NFTs out there. Um, and there's been so much going on. So I do have a couple of videos releasing over the next couple of days. But Pepper Attack, um, as we said, we're, uh, we're certainly coming down to the sharp end of, of Pepper Attack. There are still Mystic Peppers available to get. So I think at the time of the video, um, there was around about 2,000 left out of the, the 10,000. Um, uh, one Mystic Pepper, they're locked at uh, 0 0.07 uh, ETH. Um, however, on the 1st of November, they're cleaning the floor. Um, no, I wouldn't say cleaning their floor, they're raising the floor, raising the floor. And from the 1st of November, the, uh, the Peppers will be uh, 0.15 ETH. Now, why haven't they sold out? Um, from my, um, I guess, Perspective. I think a couple of reasons that they they hadn't sold out is certainly when I purchased them at 0.07 ETH, let's say a month ago, um, it cost me about 160 probably USD um, per Mystic, Mystic Pepper. Now the ETH certainly took a bit of a Ethereum took a bit of a price rise in September and, and October. So now they're around about 200, and they've so they've certainly come up a bit. Gas. Has also been a, a bit of a problem, and I know certainly re looking at the the discords, a couple of people, you know, their gas price was certainly fifty or a hundred just to buy a uh, an NFT that was a hundred and fifty, two hundred in the first place. So trying to find that right balance and in the right time to to buy it. Um, probably the second factor that I can think of is, as I said before, September and October has been crazy. Um, uh, Wanaka land sales, launch of bomb crypto, uh, green belly uh, sales. Um, what else have we got? I mean, that's just sort of tapping on a few. So there's been so many exciting games that have launched in the last sort of two weeks where people are able to buy and get an ROI uh, straight away. So, you know, you, you, if you've only got a small amount of money, you've got competing dollars. However, I think this is really now a good time to sort of jump in. Um, as I said, at the time of the video, it's what are we talking about, the 10th or something? No, 12th. Um, at the end of the month, they're gonna raise the floor. So already the value of your pepper um, is going to increase. Now, one thing I have seen as well, if we go to the, the pepper attack um, uh, collection, um, the floor is holding still. So even though ETH has been rising, Except for a couple of rogue warriors here in the 0.06, the floor is still there. 0 0.07, 0 0.08. These are sort of the first three rows. So um, those have certainly purchased at the beginning of month. Have already seen a return on their investment on that side. But that's not the exciting thing for me. The exciting thing for me as well is at the end of the month, or on the 20th of October. So eight days from now, um, those that own a pepper. If you own one pepper, you get a bronze pass. If you own six or more peppers, you get a silver. 11 or more, you get a gold. I did make a mistake last time, so we're getting it right this time. And for those insane pepper people, and there are, there's, there's I think I've seen, there's about six or seven people that have 51 plus peppers are getting a pepper dragon pass. Now, these passes are uh, once in a lifetime NFTs that will be sort of issued and there may be opportunities to reward based on having a Palooza pass. So they were talking about using it as a baseline, but these are your, founder, uh, your founders members passes. This is, denotes you not only the fact that you own a Mystic Pepper, but notes the fact that you're a Mystic, you have a, you're a founding member of those Mystic Peppers. So I think they're certainly going to get some uh, rewards for that and the NFTs as well. Um, and a couple of people have asked me sort of in Discord and other things as well is what other benefits are you getting out of there and are they just going to release more peppers? Well the answer is yes they are going to release more peppers but they are not going to release more mystic peppers. Um, so we'll just skip all this bit here and we'll go down and I think the easiest way is to, to come through here is 
there will be more peppers that actually get released because you're looking at around about five or more peppers to play the game. Um, now I don't know what other benefits the mystic peppers would have in regards to damage or so forth, but the other peppers that will be introduced to the game, you'll be able to, to buy through a sale process by using your might um, or other ones, as they said, other types of peppers or pepper ladies and so forth. And what I understand is these peppers uh, are mainly for the game content, the PvP, the PvE, uh, and the adventuring in that as well. However, only the Mystic Peppers you'll be able to stake. Um, so you'll be able to stake and you'll be able to get your, um, uh, and actually, and, and mine as well. So that staking will take effect um, at the end of this month. So it was going to was supposed to start at the beginning, but there's been a slight delay. And the main reason for that delay is, once again, we talked about the rise of uh, ETH, the gas fees in ETH. Um, so what they're doing is they're looking for a layer two migration onto uh, the Polygon Matrix uh, network, which means that your gas fees are going to be insignificant compared to sort of staking and taking away or uh, mining with, with might. So um, I believe they're just doing the testing phasing at the moment, it's coming in. So by the end of the month, um, there will be going on to the, uh, the Polygon network then we'll be able to mine, we'll be able to get the mite, the mite token will be introduced and launched. Um, and then obviously with the mite token in future periods coming in, we'll be able to use the mite to, to inter interact with the game, either buying more peppers as we said, or buying other potions or uh, items that are actually gonna increase the stats of your peppers. Um, or if you just want to farm and so forth or stake, you can take the mite, you can sell it and actually sort of look at getting a return and investment that way. Um, so just going through as we sort of said is you can still, you still have an opportunity for 18 more days effectively on the, on the video to get a Mystic Pepper um, at 0.07 ETH. On the 1st of November it will go to 15 ETH plus will be on the Polygon network. So I get, assume they're also saying that it will be equivalent, um, whatever that uh, price is on that side. Um, but more importantly, as you said, on the 20th, there will be a snapshot on the 20th, and then there will be a, uh, a free airdrop or an a NFT airdrop to those that own Peppers. So get yourself, grab one, um, uh, you know, even if you certainly grab one, um, on the 1st of November, then you'll certainly be able to mite. Now, one other thing that I also read, and I sort of didn't actually mention it before, is because of the delays as well, they're certainly giving bonuses. They're, they're a really supportive um, project in that, and you know, they certainly understand that you know, things have happened, and they're certainly not the first project out there that have had issues. Um, uh, anyone who's been involved in, in Bomber Crypto, um, Bomber Cri Bomb Crypto, um, that is, I mean, without using the thing, it's basically exploded. It's, it's, it was a messy week, an absolute messy week. And they certainly haven't been, uh, as much as they've supported their community, they haven't communicated as, as well as certainly what uh, Pepper Attack doing. The, the mods and the owners and developers are always in the channel, always talking, always working with the community. Um, and, and I really enjoyed it. I think one thing that I certainly noticed the difference is, is the community channel, even with delays or even with slight uh, issues, it is a positive community. Um, if you just want to just, like if you're having a bad day, don't jump into a PVU or a bomb crypto channel because you are just bombarded by negativity. It is crazy. Whereas the, like I said, the positive vibe I get out of uh, the Pepper Tech Attack channel uh, is awesome. Um, and they always, always just looking for ways to interact and, and, and do some concurrent activities on the side um, whilst, uh, whilst things are happening, whilst uh, the layer two migration is happening, whilst they're putting the final touches on their, uh, uh, their beta testing or alpha testing for the game um, to go through. So just to wrap up, as I said, around about 2,000 peppers left and they're at uh, 0.07 ETH. Choose your time because the gas fees can come up at the moment. Um, so have a look at it. If you jump in the Discord channel, it actually has the gas fees on the right hand side, a gas fee bot. So you can always have a look at that and the changing gas fees and then use the time to, uh, to, to, to purchase. 
have a chat around in the Discord as well. People always give you advice and, and maybe tell you the sort of time of the day or when they sort of purchase to get over those as well. On the 1st of November, it's gonna go up. Don't forget on the 20th, you, you can get yourself a Pepper Attack Palooza Pass. I'm certainly looking forward to mine and I'll certainly promote it. Um, next month, we've also got our beta test and alpha testing. So fingers crossed I can get a key and we're allowed to stream it because I'm definitely looking forward to sort of showing you some of the gameplay. Um, but uh, if you uh, haven't got yourself a Mystic Pepper by then, um, you will not be able to um, participate in the mining and get the, the mites as well. And personally, um, I don't know what price it's going to launch, but I think you're certainly going to get um, over three to four months of the staking. You're certainly, if you um, if not make a return on investment, I think you're certainly going to get close to making a return on the investment and therefore start with the launch, clean slate and get into the game. All right, guys, thank you very much. I hope you liked it. Don't forget to hit those likes down below and hit the subscribe if you'd like to see more. As I said, crazy October. I'm punching out the videos at the moment. There's certainly a lot more videos to come over the next week. Thank you. Have a good one. All right.